right alone. Next up, we are going to cover Marion County Eagles, located in Buena Vista, Georgia. Last season, they had an overall record of two and nine, and had a region record of one and three. They opened up the season with a six-game losing streak. Columbus, 30 to 25. Shaw, 24 to eight. Southland Academy, 21, 14. Hawkinville, 13 to three. Manchester, 54 to three. Greenville, 14 to 10. Central was their first win of the season. They beat them at home 66 to two. Next game, they faced Chattahoochee County. They lost to them 28 to zero. Taylor County gave them their second win of the season, a 17 to zero. And they finished up with Sly County for the last game of the season with a 56 to zero loss. Okay, I skipped one game. All right, Macon County. They lost to them 23 to 12. 23 to 12. So, looking ahead at the upcoming season, we're going to take a look at a couple games we think will be very interesting. So, Deerfield wins. I think Marion County kicks out this season with a step in the right direction. But I don't think they get the win. Next up, Shaw. I think Shaw comes away with the win in that one. Southland Academy. I think Marion County gets that first win of the season against Southland Academy. Next up, they will beat Hawkinville after that. After that, they face Manchester. I'm gonna take Manchester in that game. It's gonna be a tough game, but I think Marion County comes out on top versus Greenville. I think they get another win versus Central. Next day host Chattahoochee County. I like Chaco in that game. Manchester will get a win versus Mary. Next up, they face Taylor County. This is going to be a very interesting game. It will be on the road late in the season. If Marion County stays healthy, they will have a chance at 
Taylor Cannon. For the last, for, for the next game, Slack County. I take Slack County in that game. And for the last regular season game, also a region matchup, they face Macon County. I like Marion County in that game this year. So to recap, win over Mary, win over Macon, lost to Sly, win over Taylor, lost to Manchester, lost to Chaco, win over Central, win over Greenville, lost to Manchester. I don't know why it's saying Manchester on the schedule twice, but I'm going to go ahead on and talk about it. After that, Hawkinville, they get the win versus them. Southland Academy, I think they beat them this year. It's going to be a tough, tough, close loss at Shaw. And another loss at Deerfield wins. Let me know what you think in the comments.